real talents of people I'm talking about, and because of it, I will go to a four-year-old kid, okay? That you see is a raw talent. Four-year-old kids have two things that are so good in it. First of all, they can build, and they are building, a generic pattern to follow based on one case. Those ability to generalize is immense. For example, take a four-year-old kid, and he's touching a hot stove and getting burnt, he will not touch a hot stove again. Okay? For one case, if extrapolated a generic rule that he will follow. Correct? So, in extrapolation from, peers, from points into rules, this is an inherent capability that we have as human beings. But there is something else that typifies a four-year-old kid. What's the most favorite question of a four-year-old kid? Why? Why? And then when you answer, immediately what does it do? Why that exists? And when you answer, it's asked immediately, why? And then you say, go to your mother. Or when you grow, you will know. Okay? We are killing this fantastic talent of cause and effect in our kids. They have it. Instead of encouraging it, instead of teaching the kids of how to build maps of cause and effect, we are teaching them to memorize. And here's the end result. Here's all this industry, all this very smart people, something so obvious and it's not clear to anybody because none of us is trained in building cause and effect trees. 